Lesson three. Once you have overcome demons, dark entities, or obstacles in your path to light, what happens then? Once you have proven your strength and you have overcome the obstacles that were presented to you, the challenges that were meant to take you off of your light path, take you off of your destiny path, um, you are often rewarded. But, again, it is not so simple. You will be rewarded, but you will need to know how to go and receive that reward. After dealing with the darkness, after dealing with the problems and overcoming them, you will probably feel like just relaxing. You will probably feel like just taking a break that you have done the right thing you have proven yourself strong and you deserve a rest a relaxation a party well you know what yeah, this is right the best thing you can do after you have been faced with extreme demonic, extreme negative, extremely um, challenging situations to your light path is to take a break, go out dancing, have some fun, hang out with friends, and relax. You are rewarding yourself at this point and this is the first stage of the series of rewards that you may get to receive now if you make that mistake and I'm sorry I probably should have had you guys go through the challenge if you make that mistake and you continued going on your path without rewarding yourself um, the the likelihood is that you will find yourself exhausted on the path you may not even see a fork in the road that was coming up and you will surely 90% miss the op the the rewards the universe the earth was preparing for you for your um, completion, for your completion of the challenges, for your staying pure in the face of adversity, for um, 
and serving the light as you had to fight through the darkness. So first you must reward yourself. Because if you do not believe you are worthy of a reward, why would the earth or the universe ever believe you are worthy of a reward? So if you do not believe that the challenge you overcame deserves that you reward yourself, you've just proven to the universe that you don't really deserve a reward. Um, that's a lose-lose situation. You, you don't want that. So don't make any excuses. Don't think you got time schedules. Don't think they already slowed you down enough. Take a break. Relax. Go to a party. Dance. Treat yourself nice. Reward yourself. This will recalibrate the subconscious and conscious mind to cleanse it of the friction that was caused from having to deal with all the negativity and all of the problems that were built up within the consciousness construct while going through the attacks of the dark entities, the demons, the obstructions in the path, the, the negative forces, whether they be physical, ethereal, spiritual, whatever, the negativity, the challenges. Your um, giving to yourself is what is going to shift the conscious and subconscious mind state and then you know don't party for weeks on at a time you know have a good time and then and then um uh, be grateful for that good time and get on your way and so at this point You may have decided that those challenges you went through, this and that, um, were enough, were what you needed to learn at, from the experience of um, dealing with negative entities dealing with these problems and you may want to resume on towards the first path you were going on however now that the demons and the problems and the situations of the past are now cleared out of the past you may benefit from going back into the past and seeing if there was something for you to learn there outside of the influence of <clears throat> the demonic forces. So you may and probably So I will ask you guys, what do you think you've defeated the demons? Was that your mission? Leave the past behind you? 
move forward towards your goal? Or do you? Decide to return to the past and see if without the influence of the demons, the past had something else to teach you. You have two minutes. Go. Close your answers. So I hope you have all placed your answers. Um, the correct answer is that actually, um, yes, you should have returned back to the past. Those demons came at you at that time for a specific reason. And that was to have you move quicker through a period of time than you really should have. However, after you have defeated them, overcome them, after you have cleared the doubts out of your subconscious and you become consciously aware that you are going in the right path, you return to the past to explore what it was you could have learned if you were not being challenged, if you were not being um, attacked, if you were not being pushed by negativity. And so, probably, One of the, the most important things you will get out of going back into the past is your reward from the Mother Earth. The demons wanted to stop you from getting that reward so they made you run through quickly. You go back into the past and you look, you explore, you keep your intuition open and you will find that reward you were looking for.